Hello again, rock lovers. It's time for another cut and tumble video. This time, let's try this Parcellus agate, otherwise known as Purple Passion agate. As you can see, it does have that dark purple chalcedony in there. There's also some banding. Let's get this in the shop, cut it in half, bring it back in here, take a look at it, and then we'll get those halves rolling in a barrel, make them nice and smooth, and then make it nice and shiny. We'll hopefully have two really beautiful shiny rocks when this is all said and done. Let's get on the 10 inch saw and start the cutting. All right, the cut's finished. Now, what does this look like on the inside? Ooh, oh, that's sweet. The Parsalis agate has been cut and as you saw, it looks pretty neat. Look at that. Kind of a flame-like pattern, don't you think? Now there is a lot of this, so oh, host rock on here, which Hopefully we'll grind away and leave us with plenty of the good stuff. So next step, let's get these two pieces in the barrel, get them rolling. I'll keep them in the coarse grid as long as it takes to make these nice and smooth. And then I'll bring them back in here and show you what they look like before moving them onto the polishing stages. Well, what do you think? First, we cut this Parcellus agate and now it has been tumbled in the coarse grit for many, many weeks to get nice and smooth like this. Well, I say nice and smooth. If you look closely, you can see there are still lots of little pits and pockets and whatnots. However, I think that this rock will still take an awesome shine. Or should I say these two rocks? So let's take these now two pieces of Parcellus agate and get them started in the vibratory tumbler where I will go for eight days and use four different grits. After that final polish phase, I will bring these two pieces back in here and I'll show you what they look like. Well, what do you think? Our Parcellus agate is all finished with the cut and tumble. Now it's nice and shiny. Let's take a closer look here. Ooh, that's pretty stuff in there. It's sort of a purpley color, which of course is why they call this purple passion agate. Yeah, I like it. That rough stuff is, yeah, gets in the way, but <laughs> that part I like. Let's see, what about this side? Let's get off that and look at this. Okay, okay. Well, all things considered, I believe it's a good-looking, well, let's say, pair of rocks now. And considering where we started, quite the transformation. I hope you agree. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Oh, and please check my other videos for more like this. Thanks again.